Leave it 851, turn right heading 180. turn right 245, report localised established 27. Today's video is sponsored by Dashlane. More on them at the end of the video. The GE9X is simultaneously the most exciting engine and also one of the most headlined one for all the wrong reasons. Its sheer size in comparison to previous engines has made it a favourite for many, including myself. However, just before its first flight, it encountered major problems that caused the engines to be sent back to GE Aviation, in turn delaying the first flight of the Boeing 777X by half a year. Worse still, this occurred on quite literally the final test before it was ready to fly. Major news surrounding the engine, GE Aviation has said that they are in the final stages of testing for the 777X's engines. The final two tests that the engines are undertaking are expected to be completed by the end of November. At the time of recording, it is the 22nd of November. The benefit to having these tests actually approved is then results in test flights officially being cleared and ready to begin. Although this won't happen instantly, after the final two tests, it's incredibly positive signs. While finding any problem with an engine isn't great for GE Aviation and Boeing, it was truly found at the perfect time, as it's far better it was found now while it's still in the factory, rather than out in the field where the delays could have been longer in getting the type flying, or worse still, there could have been an incident during a test flight, which no one wants. As I've mentioned before, it isn't uncommon for new engines slash jets to encounter issues in their testing phases. However, this truly came at the worst time for Boeing, given their 737 MAX, and it's still grounded nature. Currently, the two engines are going through two separate tests, with one having an endurance test, while the other has a vibration test. Each test will focus on problems that were found earlier, and will ensure the engines are ready for full service when attached to the Boeing 777X, with the 777-9 being the first variant to take to the skies sometime early next year. Now, the GE9X currently has a backlog of some 700, as it is the sole provider for the 777X series. Recently, though, we saw orders deferred from Emirates in what they're calling a fleet rejig to prioritize their future operations and maximize efficiency. And now for our returning sponsor, Dashlane. Dashlane is an application that secures all your personal login information. As aviation enthusiasts, Dashlane means you don't have to carry around a book full of passwords and even try and remember them when you're trying to get into your various airline and airport accounts. I'm sure most of you have quite a lot of accounts and it can be difficult to try and remember all the login details. You can store all of that information on Dashlane. When you're in a rush to buy a flight, even a Dashlane will be there to provide you with the necessary information at a moment's notice with their handy autofill feature. You may ask, is it safe? Well, Dashlane actually uses a master password to encrypt all of your data, so only you know that password and it's not stored on servers. Plus, you've got a VPN there to be safe in public Wi-Fi areas, just like the airport or when you're traveling. And you can download it today as viewers of my channel and get it free for the rest of your life on your first device at dashlane.com forward slash aviation. If you do decide you want to download it on another device, you can use my code aviation to get 10% off. And thank you very much for tuning into this video of mine. If you have any thoughts on the GE9X being ready to be launched with the 777X, do let me know in the comment section below. And as always, I will see you all in the next one.